So this is day two of my Cocky Tales vlogging, um, and I'm on Novela number two. My name is Jess, welcome to my channel. And Novela two is called Double Cooked, oh, sorry, I'm still waking up. Double Cocked by Jana Aston. And what the blurb for it says is, this is super short, super dirty, and the heroine is a real bitch. You've been warned. So I just finished Jenna Aston's uh, Double Cocked, and yeah, definitely uh, go with the warning because she is a bitch. I actually liked her up until chapter three, <laughs> and it is just, wow, the mindset you get from this girl, crazy, and I'm surprised how it all goes, but I loved loved the short little epilogue. Yes. Um, wow. Um, if I was basing my rating on this little novella, on the character itself, I'd probably give it a two. But I'm not. I'm going basing it on the whole plot line and setup like I usually do. And I will definitely give this four stars. So... Double Cocked from Jenna Aston is getting four stars from me. Next up is The Cockshire Grin by Whitney Bart Betty. And the synopsis says Millie thinks all she needs are her chicken pajama pants and sad microwave nachos until she meets Ben. A man with a grin who is more than just the stranger she sh thinks he is. Hmm. The setup is predictable, however the beginning is awesome. They fall f over, or they kind of connect over a car, and <laughs> that leads to lusty feelings right away into a circumstance that they're unsure of, but for sure um, for sure, ah, the cocksure grin, sorry, I forgot the title of it, um, from by Whitney Barber, Barbetty is getting five stars. Oh my goodness, I am infatuated with both characters. I love the buildup for this short little read. Um, it is full of sexy time fun, but then it's just the funny, cute little things that you see that all I can think of is going all throughout the whole thing. And the ending, like real life in a way, ends just so cute. Definitely five stars. So, the next one is... A Wicked Cocky Plan, a prequel to Wicked Force by Sawyer Bennett. And the little synopsis goes, story, short story prequel to Wicked Force featuring Kynan McCarth, McGarth, sorry, from the Wicked Horse Vegas series. Kynan will be spinning off a new series called Jameson for Security in March 2019. Ooh, here we go. Okay, so let's give a little background to, uh, from what I found out for um, A Wicked Cocky Plan is, like I said, the prequel to uh, Wicked Force, which, yeah, you can't see that, but um, it's a Wicked Horse Vegas slash Big, si Big Sky Novela, um, and it is Sawyer Bennett's, um, from what she says on the Cocky Tales is that it's coming out March uh, 2019, and at the beginning of the novella, it said that um, it, even though it's a mixture of this novel here, uh, 
or it's going to be within a series that is coming up uh, for um, it's called Jameson for security series that she is has in the works um, but the upcoming novella Wicked Force um, is a Kristen Pro Proby crossover collection features a new novel by Kristen Proby and six of her other favorite writers so um, Wicked Force is in the mixture of this little thing and so that should be really interesting that comes out in um, March 2019 anyway sorry for the gibberish so for my thoughts on Miss Sawyer Bennett's a wicked cocky plan which is the prequel to a wicked force it is definitely run by Keenan, who is very, very cocky. Um, he is the owner, and uh, him and Rachel, I believe, actually run the business, but he's definitely the owner of it. Um, and his ex basically... Um, his ex Jocelyn comes into the picture again and she has a stalker and only feels that him, uh, Keenan, can really protect her. And this is about him, this prequel is about him agreeing to it and such. And you get to see him in a interesting situation where when he gets the call, he's having sexy times with a stranger for the most part and then it works into the background of okay can he really commit to this or not um so yeah it's a nice setup it's a nice premise for this upcoming novella the reason that it's not m for me completely is because I'm not the type to really love mystery novels even if they're have the romance attached to it they don't always hook me so, I'm going to have to give it 3.5 out of 5 stars, only because it's just, it didn't hook me that well. But I know it's just the prequel, so that really shouldn't say anything, but that's just how I feel, and that's just how it goes. So, I recommend it. I am interested and definitely intrigued for the upcoming novella that this is a precursor to, and I hope you check it out. So, yes. A Wicked Cocky Plan is getting 3.5 stars. Um, all of these novels are going to be written up in a book review later on. Once I finish reading all these, the star ratings are going to stay the same. So whatever I say on these vlogs is what's going to be there, but I'm going to talk about them more, about my thoughts a bit more on each novella. And then the whole novelist series, uh, anthology together. So yeah, I hope you like this video. This actually ended up being day two through f day four. Um, and I don't think I'll be getting another video for this out tonight. But you'll get, definitely get something tomorrow. Um, thank you for sticking around. Please like or dislike this video as you see fit. Um... I have a whole lot more of these little novelas to do for this um, Cocktails Anthology, so please stick around if you're interested in this series. I do recommend it thus far. I have not read any bad stories yet. I really like them from what I've read of them. And if you don't mind a lot of sexy times, because hey, come on, that is what it's all about. Um, then I definitely recommend you picking it up. All links are below or yeah, no, all links are below. Sorry. <laughs> I hope you have a good day. Please stick around because you have no idea what in the world's going to happen on this channel next. Take care.